Hi, I'm Dr. Partha Nandy from Ask Dr. Nandy, and today we're talking about how to stop a killer. That is, how to stop colon cancer. Now, colon cancer is the number two cancer killer in our country in the U.S. We have 50,000 people that will die from colon cancer in 2015, and 133,000 people will be diagnosed with it. So what is colon cancer? Colon cancer is when you have abnormal cells in the colon and rectum that then form tumors or cancers in the colon. Now people say, who's at risk? Am I at risk for colon cancer? Really, everybody's at risk, and we recommend that after age 50 you get screened uh, with a test called colonoscopy. However, if you have a family history of colon cancer, a first degree relative that is mother, father, brother, or sister, you're at increased risk. If you have a history of inflammatory bowel disease, so Crohn's disease or ulcerative colitis, you're at increased risk. African Americans are at increased risk. Eastern European Jews are at increased risk. Now those are risk factors you can't really do anything about. What about risk factors you can change? Well, if you have a diet that's high in fat, high in red meat, if you're a smoker, if you have a sedentary lifestyle, that is, you don't exercise very much, then those are risk factors that you can modify. So stop smoking, get exercise. Have a diet that's low in saturated fat, low in red meat. Those can all help. So people say, well, how do I know when I have colon cancer? Often there are no symptoms whatsoever. And that's a key. I want you to remember this. That often there are no symptoms of colon cancer. If you do have symptoms, it can be bleeding, rectal bleeding, changing the way your bowels move, abdominal pain. Sometimes you can have weight loss. But often you have no symptoms whatsoever. So People say, Doc, well, what can I do about it? You may not have any symptoms, so how would I know? Well, we recommend that at age 50 you get screened with a test called a colonoscopy, the best test out there to detect small growths called polyps. So polyps are, are, are small little growths in the colon that can go on to become cancer. We don't think all of these polyps can become cancerous, but we think almost all colon cancer comes from these polyps. So if you have a colonoscopy, which is painless, and only lasts about 15 to 20 minutes. This colonoscopy examines your entire colon and can remove these polyps and thus prevent colon cancer. Even if you have an early cancer and detect it with a colonoscopy, you have many treatment options and you should see your doctor. Now, we said age 50 for most people. If you're African American, we recommend age 45. If you have any of the risk factors we talked about, please consult your doctor to see when you should be screened. Remember, be your own health hero. Get screened to prevent colon cancer. For more details, go to ask Dr.